Welcome back to In Focus. Now, up and coming African fashion designers recently showcased their works at a fashion fair in Nairobi, Kenya. VOA's Carolyn Turner has more on that. The annual fashion fair held in Nairobi last week showcased designers from more than seven countries. Models strutted down the runway wearing vivid colors and traditional cloth sewn into figure hugging dresses, skirts, and pants. Rwanda designer Masira Matali says his collection was inspired by the recent Haiti earthquake and the 1994 genocide in his country. The 12 pieces in his collection were made mostly from waste products. I got the inspiration. It's, uh, it's because of the Haiti, Haiti uh, problems. I was in my room and uh, watching the TV. Uh, what I saw it was amazing for me. It's like uh, maybe what happened to Rwanda, to, to the genocide. I'm a genocide survivor. So I would like to show the people how, um, how the physical pain with dressing, how can show uh, the pain in the clothes. Doreen Gathambi, a fashion student in Nairobi, was enthusiastic. It was really nice. We, um, I got a lot of inspiration. There's a lot of talent in Africa. It gives us hope and you see like there's a big turnout so we know that there are people who are there to support us as designers. Yeah, I liked all the collections, especially the last one. The headline designs were from Senegal's Bazimo Sebastian, whose bold collection in pink silk with matching clutch bags and shoes excited the crowd. Kenyan designer Lucy Rayo who is one of the fashion fair organizers, says African designs are poised to take off. I really think there's something about African fashion which is about to explode. Because when you go to almost every African country, they're doing something about fashion. Yeah? And this time we had the opportunity to invite other designers from other African countries, some whom are uh, perhaps a little, was a little behind in fashion, a few who are ahead of us in fashion, and we all put ourselves in one part of the African fashion fair and we showcased it. Next year, organizers plan to attract even more designers to create the sort of buzz seen in African fashion centers such as Cape Town. Carolyn Turner, VOA News.